when America trusted floppy disks to control nukes. Until 2019, America's nuclear weapons ran on 8-inch floppy disks. These ancient storage devices came from the 1970s. Each floppy disk holds only 80 kilobytes of data. The entire nuclear arsenal ran on an IBM Series 1 computer. This computer was built in 1976. The 40-year-old system controlled intercontinental ballistic missiles. It managed nuclear bombers and tanker aircraft. The system sent emergency action messages for nuclear strikes. It was designed to last 30 to 50 years. Military leaders kept it because it still worked. There were benefits to using such old technology. The system was well understood and stable. Hackers couldn't break into a floppy disk. The computers weren't connected to the internet. This made them secure from cyber attacks. But the ancient technology created serious problems. Floppy disks were slow and expensive to distribute. They held far less data than modern systems. Replacement parts became impossible to find. The nuclear program faced constant equipment shortages. In 2014, three nuclear bases shared one special wrench. The wrench was needed to attach warheads to missiles. Each base had to wait its turn. The military finally got each base its own wrench. By 2017, the floppy disk system was obsolete. The replacement took two more years to finish. In June 2019, the military installed solid-state storage. The new system increased storage capacity dramatically. It also cut response times for nuclear commands. America's nuclear weapons finally entered the 21st century.